Welcome back, do-it-yourself enthusiasts. Today we're diving into a unique project that'll add a touch of luxury to your golf cart. Painting your seats with Duplicolor vinyl and fabric paint. I'm Waylon and let's get started. The materials you'll need will be Duplicolor vinyl and fabric paint, any type of mild soap or degreaser, some paper towels like shop towels, and a scuffy pad to prep the surface for the paint to stick to. These seats have been sprayed for at least about a year now with the Duplicolor vinyl and fabric paint and they look just as good as when we put them on there. Holds up well, it doesn't rub off on your clothes and it looks great. Alright, let's begin by cleaning the seats thoroughly using a mild soap or degreaser and a scuffy pad to remove any dirt and grime. This is also going to help that surface be a little bit rougher for the paint to stick. Once we do that, we're going to allow the seats to dry completely. For this next part, you want to be sure that you've already removed any of your hinges attached to your seats, hip restraints, or the plastic backings on some of the backrest. Alright, so we're going to shake this for about 30 seconds. That sets everything in a can. You want to go at this nice and evenly. Try to stay along your edges as you're painting it. Stay with the lines. Don't go at it like you're a manic graffiti artist. So we're going to start by keeping the spray pattern about 8 to 12 inches away from the surface. And we're going to do a light coat at first to make sure everything acclimates. Make sure any of these pleated areas that you get from different angles to get into those little cracks and crevices. Just keep going with a uniform coat, a light coat. If you miss anything, that's all right. We can come back later for that. And kind of trace out your hard edges here. And then keep the surface, the paint direction going the same way. And then get that bottom boxing around the edges. Make sure you get a little bit underneath it. Boxing in front. Get that spot a little bit more. And that's it for the first coat. It's been about 10 or 15 minutes. We're gonna go ahead and apply our second coat. And that may be enough. Um, if you don't feel like it is, you can add another coat 10 to 15 minutes after this coat. stuff goes on really well so that first coat really got a, a good solid uh, coating on all the vinyl. So I think this next coat will be enough to fill in anything we might have missed. Attacking these pleats at different angles because if you go this way you might be missing the spots on the other side of those pleats that you can't normally reach with one direction. And for more textured vinyl, you probably want to do more of an aerial shot with it if you can to drop that paint into those little spots. There we go, that's looking great. So after about 15 minutes, you have this beautiful top coating. And it looks wonderful right now. We'll come over here, we'll see on our cart. It's looking just as good as these seats we did nearly a year ago. All right, if you like that project, be sure to like and subscribe and visit ArkhamEV.com. Thanks for joining us.